Ah, nice day for a flamethrower. Armed and extremely dangerous. It's my own personal kick-ass version of a military flamethrower. They've arrived at exactly the right location. The first rule of firing a flamethrower in the state of California is that you pretty much can't do it. But if somehow you get permission to do it, like we have, you need to do it in a place where you're not going to set anything on fire. And that's what brings us here to the Yolo County Bomb Range in Northern California. Acres of barren landscape where we can fire our flamethrower to our heart's content. The danger lies in the risky combination of flammable liquids and high pressure. And here's how it works. I've got two tanks full of fuel. I've got a third tank full of inert gas at high pressure that I'll use to pressurize the fuel tanks such that when I pull on this lever, all of that fuel will empty out the end of this gun and burn in about four seconds. Cue pyrotechnician extraordinaire, J.D. Street, the man tasked with overseeing the safe use of an extremely dangerous piece of equipment. Thank you. Yep. And with the tanks now filled with gasoline, Secondary valve opening up. Adam and Jamie. Safety's off. Get set for the first live lit test. You're open. The gun is hot. The pressure on. It's time to let rip. First flame test in three, two, one. That worked. That worked. Wow, that was spooky as hell. Jamie just test fired our home built flamethrower and it worked fantastically. I think that might be the scariest thing that uh, has ever been built on this show. It's right up there. <laughs> <laughs> it looked to spray a wand of hot death between 60 and 80 feet, which is exactly where we wanted it to be. Oh! The stream of burning gasoline successfully matches the mythical clip for distance and volume. But for the test itself, Adam will have to stand in the line of fire, literally. To do that, he's going to use a safe house. And here's one he prepared earlier. Right here. Before we actually conduct the full-size experiment, we need to make sure that my shield here will actually do its job. Uh, I need to be able to stand in the path of this flamethrower and not get burnt. You ready? I'm ready. So, Jamie's going to point it right at this thing while there's no one behind it and fire it. And only if we determine that it will safely keep me from getting burnt are we going to use it. Glass house. Flame test. In three, two, one. keep me safe it looked good well the device is working perfectly the flame looks exactly like it does in the clip that we're trying to replicate and the glass house seems to be holding up just fine so i think adam's going to be safe i think that worked beautifully